once again, we're not going to go through my recipes right now. I'm not comfortable with it. <clears throat> I'm just going to try to slap out some good artwork. Those of you who appreciate it, you'll appreciate it. Those who don't, you won't. Get this uh, tile a little better in the middle here. Got some pillow already from doing a couple paintings so far. This is going to be video number two. We're just going to paint. Throw me down some pillow. Get it worked down here to these edges a little bit. Those of you who know me, you know I don't like a lot of pillow. I'm not sure why. I just can't get comfortable with having too much pillow, I guess. Or maybe it's not too much, but some people it works out fine. I can't get pillow to work out. I'm sure someone will tell me the deep secret about pillows someday. But right now, I just, I don't like a whole lot of pillow. Got to and I, I tried to tell myself I wasn't going to do this, but I got two coasters over on my drying table right now. And I already see I got this feeling going, so I'm going to try and make four of them, even though some people tell me don't make them the same. But I'll tell you from selling... A lot of times people want four of that match. So I'm going to try to get four to kind of feel the same. Get that green under there. Put a little interference violet on top. I'm loving, loving this coral. This pigment from uh, Primary Elements. That's the coral berry. Oh my, I love this color. This aqua blue up in here. That's a beautiful color too. Try to lay down a little less color each color you put on here. This one here, I'm just gonna drop a little bit of this on top. That's a color shift red flash. Put my cell activator on there. If you go to Video one, I explain exactly what's in this wonderful little cell activator here. I'm just gonna put a bunch of this here in the middle. Maybe not a bunch, you wouldn't call it a bunch, I guess. Just a little drop there. I'm gonna tilt this in here because it's falling off the edge of my coaster. Turn on some extra light. Thank you, camera crew. And then we're gonna Take our torch really quick, see a few bubbles, and get them out of there. Then we're gonna blow this out. We'll let that collect. I think I got a little work to do in the center there, but I started to see some real good stuff over here, so I didn't want to lose it. We'll let that start to collect. Dude, these cells here are wow. They're, these ones are staring at me. They're like three-dimensional popping up out of here. Oh, yes, I don't want to lose that. So I, I'm going to tilt this a little toward this direction. I, I want to save that. I may have to puff some in that middle. But I know if I do at this point, because I can already see that green I first laid down there, I'm probably going to get into that um, pillow paint. I don't want to get in there. I'm just going to let this collect. This could take some time, people. Let's be patient, because this is beautiful. <clears throat> that looks really good. That is looking so good. I'm going to let that collect. Be patient with us, folks. Yeah, that's looking real nice. Try to tip it a little bit up again here, see if we can get it to move over there. Let me go ahead and while that's collecting in here, 
I'm going to blow these edges out. Not where my cells are, but just the edges of the color to help it move when I go to spin in this. I'm going to let this try to collect up as much as I can. I may puff in there with a the straw a little bit. I might. I'm trying to get better with that straw, but I don't want to lose any of this. This stuff is just, that's fantastic. I'm just doing a little bit of that to help it move here once I get to spinning this thing. That's looking, yeah, that's a, that's phenomenal in there. Let's try to puff in here with this straw. Everyone cross your fingers, please, because I don't want to ruin this thing, man. Now I'm just blowing very lightly in there. I got a few to pop up in there, so that that should help. I don't see the paint running to one side or the other, so let's just keep working on this a little bit. Yeah, it's getting to where getting to where it wants to touch that pillow uh, we're just gonna leave it we're gonna be patient folks you got be patient with me here we'll we'll have a we'll have a little bit of fun we'll find my skewer and we'll we'll wreck some of the edges of this thing get get it in your acrylic but don't go through to your pillow Give you some some nice little business in these stuff here. Like I say, try not to get in your pillow. And one thing I always try to do, and this is gonna be one of my secrets that I give away right now. I always try to draw a heart in here somewhere. If I can draw a heart in here somewhere, it makes my wife happy. She likes to see them hearts in there. Now, when she's not looking, I draw dragons and fire. That's helping out a little bit. I'm just, uh, I'm seeing that center is too white still. So, I'm serious, people, please be patient. Most of the time, this would go quicker, but. I don't want to lose or ruin any of this. So I'm being patient. Letting some of this lacing start to change color. Once it starts to change color, we'll start to move it around. It's a little... I mean, that's... That's some nice stuff right there. Okay, let's spin it slow. I just I just want this to move out. I don't want that white to get too big in the middle, hopefully. Oh, looky here. Slow it down, slow it down. No paint really flung off yet, but Man, we gotta make sure we got the uh, keep the wife happy cardboard up here. At least for now, everybody. We're still upstairs in the dining room. But guess what? 
got a new studio coming downstairs. <laughs> We're gonna be moving. We're gonna be moving to where I can fling paint all over the walls. No, I can't do that, sorry. But I'll be having a new studio in the basement coming up. Oh my lord, oh my lord. We are all gonna have to thank him for this right here. That painting that through me, ew. I got a little bit more spinning. I'm gonna take my putty knife. I'm gonna grab some of the color that kind of matches this a little bit, like this right here, that matches. I'm just gonna touch the tip here and let it fall over there. Well, that didn't match at all, but it ain't gonna matter. It's gonna come off of there. Like that, a little edge here, just to help these corners fling off on this next spin. Once these corners fling off, I'm gonna put this in an art gallery. Yeah, that's beautiful. Go counterclockwise on this. It might look goofy in your camera view here. I don't know what direction it looks like in there, but that was counterclockwise. And then we're gonna leave it. We're not touching this thing no more. That's going over on the drying table.